Hey boos, let's get spooky. Today I wanted to talk to you guys about your day of birth meaning. Which day of the week were you born on? The seven days of the week correspond with seven major planets in astrology. Each day corresponded to a planet, god, or goddess. And thus, each day is drenched in their power. The day of your birth can reveal powerful, interesting secrets about you and your own destiny. If you don't know which day you're born on, don't worry. Super easy fix. You look it up. Um, calendars for every year are available. I believe I was born on a Saturday, but let me double check. So all I did was Google 1997 calendar and I found November and mine is in fact a Saturday. I don't know, it's not really focusing, but I try. I'm trying. <laughs> Monday, the day of the moon. You are a child born with grace. Artemis or Diana is your goddess. The lunar forces bless the child born on Monday with tremendous psychic abilities, a gift to understand others, and the gift of empathy. Monday children are very sensitive, yet they get easily angered as they feel very frustrated with the emotions of others. Usually, they are gentle and soft-spoken as the light of the moon sweetens them from the inside. Most Monday children are said to suffer from insomnia as the moon watches them at night and cannot easily let her children fall asleep. Monday children have a natural ability for glamour and beauty spells. So if you're into spells, you might be best at those. And they also have very powerful healing magic. The key to unlock their power is water, as the ancient magic taught us that the moon rules over all waters. If you were born on Tuesday, that is the day of Mars, and you're a child born with Valor. Probably going to pronounce this wrong. Tyres, the Norse war god, sorry, and Aries, they rule Tuesday as well. <laughs> Those are your gods. Um, the passion of Mars blesses the children born on Tuesday with a fiery will and great enthusiasm. Tuesday children act spontaneously and love to always take what they want. They are warriors and this is either easily noticed or ignored. Their calling is to calm their power and become the brave children of Mars, as the god of war intended. Self-righteousness is one of their characteristics as a child, but as they grow up, they will realize that more opinions are needed to be expressed to see both sides. You're also prone to accidents, but considered very faithful and mighty. They have a natural ability for offensive spells, fighting evil, and exorcisms. They are also very good at channeling enthusiasm and inspirations. Hence, the key to unless unlocking their powers is enthusiasm and inspiration. If you were born on Wednesday, you are ruled by Mercury and you're a child born with agility. Your gods are Odin, the Norse god of wisdom, and Hermes. Hermes. I'll put it on screen. I don't know how to pronounce names. I'm sorry. Um, the wisdom and agility of Mercury blesses the child born on Wednesday with a very strong, practical, and powerful mind. Curiosity is second nature to them, and they have a natural talent for business and communication. Their calling is to discover and learn more and more every day. Children born on Wednesday are gifted with the ability to cope 
with different stimulus at the same time, giving them the ability to multitask and make them great at almost any job. It is said that children born on Wednesday are usually very happy with their lives. Wednesday children also have a natural ability in astral project projection and telepathy as their consciousness is extremely powerful and they know how to control it. The key to unlocking their magical powers is their curiosity. Wow. Thursday babies, your planet is Jupiter. If you were born on Thursday, you are a child born with nobility. Um, your gods are Thor, the Norse god of thunder, and Zeus. The royal nature of Zeus blesses these children with optimism and good luck. They have a strong sense of justice, which blesses them with respect from others and gives them a strong ability to know exactly what's good for them and chase that at a very young age. They attract attention and opportunities, hence doors, opens, doors open right in front of them. These children are gifted with the ability to find their way to success. Although this may take time, they are often well-behaved yet sincere, which sometimes causes them problems. They have a natural ability for good luck spells and spells of any kind of success or evolution. The key to unlocking and igniting their powers is optimism. Wow. All right, if you were born on Friday, your planet is Venus. Um, you're likely born with charms. Ooh, fancy. Uh, your gods are f gods, goddesses, whatever. Freya, the Norse goddess of love and beauty, and Aphrodite. Oh my goodness, you guys must be gorgeous. <laughs> the great enchantress of the Pantheon blesses these children with natural ability to enchant almost anything once they accept their, natural, their nature and realize how beautifying they are. Believe you're beautiful, babes. It's self-confidence, bro. They are extremely talented artistically and have had an amazing ability to bring peace, harmony, and beauty wherever they go. It is said that the shadow of the child born on Friday can beautify anything that falls onto it. As they grow older, they tend to understand their powers more and begin to realize that beauty can be found in the most unusual, strange, and amazing places. These children are kind-hearted with the ability to soften people whose hearts have been broken or are broken. They have the natural ability for love, beauty, and peace spells, and generally they know this. The key to unlock their powers, direct their charms, and make their spells even stronger is satisfaction. So, you know, get on that. If you were born on a Saturday, like moi, and I think almost all my sisters too, your planet is ruled, your day is ruled by Saturn or Kronos, um, and you are born with power. Exciting. The god of time blesses these children with extremely magical powers. I mean, I'd say so. I am an empath and a medium so you know <laughs> saturn is said to be the planet of the witches thus children born on this day are said to have a very strong sometimes ridiculously strong abilities these children are hard workers who are determined to go as far as they have to in order to find exactly what they're looking for they can endure much and are very patient. They tend to be materialistic and often this is a prison that their spirit desperately wants to try to escape. Once these, ch these children realize their divine nature, nothing will be able to stop them. These children are born with the ability to manifest anything, they say, as long as they believe it. 
They have a natural ability to perceive evil influences and send them afar. Ooh. The key to unlocking the po their power is honesty. Wow. So just tell your truth, my guys. And finally, Sunday, uh, the day of the sun. So you're ruled by the sun. And you are a child born with light. Go figure, right? Associated with Apollo, um, god of sun and light, these children are blessed with generosity, valor, and honor. They are great at sports, talented in the arts, and possess great magical powers. These children are noble but not humble and they are very generous as long as it's as long as it is appreciated. They are optimistic, feeling that life will soon smile at them. Generally that they hang with many people who most likely admire them, but only have a few strong friends. They are sensual people but somehow very hurt by love. They have good hearts and like to help anyone in need. Ooh, thank you, uh, helpers. They have a natural ability to cast any spell as long as it requires a candle as the flame symbolizes their natural divine nature and origin from the sun. They are inspired people who have the right with magic and the key to unlocking their powers is faith. That does not mean faith in God. It did not say faith in God. Believe whatever you want, just have faith. But that is it for today's video. Shout out to, um, crap. <laughs> Intuitive on Facebook. It's a Facebook page. Um, they posted that. So shout out to them. Thank you so much for watching. Please let me know what day you were born and how you feel about what it says about you because I feel like mine's pretty on there. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did give this video a thumbs up. If you like this video or like videos like this, I suggest subscribing if you aren't already um, because I bring to you more posts every week, every Saturday. And you know, if you want even more of me, I have so many channels and they are all linked below posting weekly content. I am on it. So thank you guys so much for watching again. I love you and I'll see you next time with a new video. <laughs> I love you so much and I will see you next time with a new video. Bye!